Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys. And today guys, I'm going to go ahead and be showing you how to create user stories in Trello. This is a very simple thing to do guys, so make sure to watch this quick and easy video till the very end and follow my steps correctly so you can make sure this works the same for you and that you can do this yourself. But yeah guys, let's get straight into it. So guys, the first thing you want to do is go ahead and open up the official Trello website right here at Trello.com if you haven't already. And after opening up the website, guys, you want to go ahead and log into your account that you want to create user stories with. After logging into your account, go ahead and create a one if you do not already have one. But after logging in, you'll be greeted by this main page right here, which is the home page of Trello, where you can see all of your boards, you can see your workspace and so on. So let's go ahead and see how you create the option to add user stories to your board. The first thing we want you to do guys is go ahead and open up the board where we want the user stories to be. So I'm going to open up this board right here by clicking on it, call tutorial, and after clicking on the board, now we can see that this is our board right here. And what we want you to do first to be able to add user stories is click the three dots right here in the upper right corner. So click the three dots right here next to the share button, click the three dots, that's going to open up this menu right here with all the options you can access. And one of the options is called power ups. So we want to use power ups to be able to create user stories. Click on power ups, and after clicking on power ups, it's going to open up this menu right here where we can see all the power ups that we can add. So we can use the search bar right here and we can search for something like stories. You can either just search for stories, then you'll have your uh, agile story maps right here, or personas and so on, car family and so on, or you can search directly for user stories. And as you can see, we have a power. Uh, up that is called personas where we can create user and buyer personas so now we can go ahead and add this power up to our board right here and then we can get started with using it this is how we can create user stories but yeah guys basically that is it how to do it so i hope this video was helpful if it was make sure to leave a like subscribe to the channel see you guys thank you for watching take care and bye